Hi, this is Steve. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a REST API and use basic authentication to connect to it. So I've created a folder on my local domain called API, and I'm going to create a basic uh, page called basic.php, which is where we're going to put our code. The first thing we're going to do is set out a header saying that if the authorization method is not set, to send a 401 unauthorized header back. So to send this header, we're going to type in header www-authenticate, and then we're going to call this basic, and I need to specify the realm, and we're going to call this the private area. Now I need to add a second closing quote here for the www quote, and we're going to test this. Now I'm going to copy and paste the address into Postman, which is a really useful tool for API development. Here you can see a 401 unauthorized, and let's check the headers. And there you will see the Authenticate Basic Realm uh, indication. That's telling the user that this is the type of authentication we're going to use. So we're still not done. We need to send out another header here, so let's get that going. The header we're going to send out is a 401 unauthorized if they do not have the basic authentication protocol set. And let's also, when we're done with this, send out a message to the user saying you are not authorized. Alright, let's test this. Oh wait, I forgot an exit, because we want to exit out if they don't have this. We send the request again, we should get back. There you go. Sorry, you need proper credentials. All right, so that works. So how do we use basic authentication? Well, we're going to create an else statement here, and then we're going to put in the required authentication. So we're going to say else, if I could type it correctly. Now. If the server requests username, so now this is PHP auth user. All right, there it is right there. So if that username, let's just call it, let's say, Bill. Now, if they have the uh, username of Bill, they need to have a password. So we're going to say and. the server PHP auth password, and we're going to type that like this. Not that one. PW. And then we're going to give it a password. Let's call it, just for an example, 1234. Okay. Now, if they have that, then they're in the authenticated area. So let's print out a success message. Okay. Now, if they're not in there, then we need to send out a, a 401 unauthorized header. And we're going to do that like this. So basically, if they're not in there, I'm going to copy and paste the code from above, which basically has the same headers, that they're not authorized, and then send out an error message. Now let's test this in Postman. We're going to go over to the Authorization tab, and then select Basic Authorization as the protocol. And here we're going to type in our username and password. So the username is Bill. And the password is 1234, and let's send the request. And there you see we are in the private area, and we have a 200 status code, which is a success in HTTP. So that's how you set up a basic authentication protocol using a REST API in PHP.